Photo, and I'm here today to uh, show you a little unboxing of the stuff I got from Elwood Clothing. So I just want to tell you something real quick. I, uh, I purchased a green bomber. It's a nylon bomber. It looks pretty thin. And then I got a pair of black joggers. And then I got a mesh baseball jersey. And I got the jersey just because it's burgundy and it's going to match my uh, Jordans. But I had a 10% discount. And so I did that. And then the next day I find out you can get 40% off on the jacket that I ordered. So I was a little upset about that. But I did the math and really with the 10% and the free shipping I already had, it evened out. So there was no point of like, you know, bitching at someone. So let's just get into it real quick. So I already tore it open. So first off we have our standard pack and slip that comes with every purchase of something. Someone always puts a pack and slip, you know, your receipt or whatever. And then we got first is the burgundy mesh jersey, size small. That was originally, I have no idea. Uh, yeah, I don't know, but it was on sale for like $9. So I just like, whatever, it matches my Jordans. Size small. Hand it to my assistant. <laughs> so I live that life. Here it is, it's pretty nice. Nothing on the back or front, it's pretty simple. And then right here we have the Elwood Nylon, it's pretty thin, uh, bomber jacket. This was originally 48 bucks. Then we have the bomber. And to my lovely assistant. Oh, it's pretty nice. I'm digging it. Size medium. And then we have last is the Elwood Stretch Twill Jogger in black. Size small. That's why I wear in joggers. I have, I have a black pair of joggers, but they're like faded biker denim, so I wanted an all pair, like an all black pair, my bad. And then it has like these little silver, or like a gunmetal tips. There's no ending on them, but it's whatever. And those were 20 bucks. So total with the discount and everything, it all came out to like $76, but I'm about to throw these on for you. So what we got going on right now, right here, is the burgundy mesh jersey. And um, so the one that I told you about earlier, the white one I had picked up, that was size small as well. I got it from Buffalo Exchange in Portland. I'm not from there. We don't have one where I'm, where I'm from. And so I picked those up, or that up. And it fits nice too, but the quality doesn't feel as good as this one. Maybe because, you know, it hasn't been used or, you know, picked up at like a boutique or whatever. Um, or a consignment shop, whatever the word is. But brand new it feels like really nice so I guess maybe it just depends on how you wash it I don't know but right now I wanted to show you like a full fit so at the bottom I have my uh, maroon sixes you know maroon burgundy they're basically the same for the most part so I just wanted to wear a fit that had that and then with the off-white on the shoes using like an off-white elongated tee for the back you know pop out a little more and then I have my uh, black Nixon for the fit so I'm just going to show that off for a minute. So, in this bomber jacket, like I said earlier, it's pretty thin. As you can tell, it's not puffy. Um, it's kind of like an M or MA1 style, you know, with the, like, the side and all that. But it's not very thick at all, and it has, according to my lady, it says ruching. It's ruching? Yeah, it's ruching. So kind of like the ripples or whatever, like a crunched up look to it. And I'm not gonna lie, even though it looks pretty dope, like, you do this, it's kind of tight in the back. So I don't wanna like rip it or anything. But, and the sleeves are a little long, so sometimes what I do on other jackets and stuff, I'll just like cuff it. I'll roll it up one so you can see the watch. You get the, you get the idea. But 
we've got regular pockets here, no pockets right here in the right arm. Um, I'm guessing the back is pretty basic. And just like a little holder and then a zip for the pocket right here. Uh, no inside pockets either, but it's a very nice jacket. It's pretty clean with the white shoes too. <laughs> Thank you for watching the video all the way through. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, please. You know, I'm just starting out, so I'm going to need the help and support that I can get. Um, since I'm so new to this, you know, if you could put something down in the comments to help me out, you know, that'd be pretty nice. Um, please subscribe, you know. I'm still trying to work out, putting these videos out. But you know how it is. It's tough out there going to school and all that. But stay fresh, stay fly, fuck bitches all the time. I'm checking out. Too much. Want to see it? You shouldn't ask me.